Hey guys, it's Arsenal Dev. Today I have another tutorial. It's a really short tutorial on how to make an HD resource pack. So you can make the regular default pixel size, which is not HD, 16 by 16 pixels. Um, and yeah, it just looks regular. So you can kind of make it look like a cartoon kind of thing. It's kind of really hard to put good details in it, but you still can. Um, so I'm going to show you how to make it so it is HD so you're gonna open GIMP and you're gonna need GIMP for this so the uh, download for GIMP is in or the link for the download of GIMP is in the description so check that out default resource pack is also in the description so remember to check that out when the video ends and you know how to do all of this so it's really not hard if you watch the first video like I recommend you watch it cuz uh, it's pretty much gonna tell you the basics of how to make a texture pack with GIMP so you're gonna have to open the file so let's just show you so once you get the file you'll get these two things and you'll get something in here wait one sec <clears throat> okay so while it does that let's see so you'll get the assets so you'll get so I just made a folder you can create any folder so you just right click and then new and then you uh, choose a name so like texture pack I'll just put one there just because it's already taken but you know I don't need that because I have this one right here so uh, you have in so inside you have assets pack.mc meta you'll need those files to keep it so this is where everything is saved like all the pictures are in for the blocks and items so uh, let's see I'm just gonna go here just take it back out uh, open resource pack folder so you guys really don't have to do this unless it's in there so uh, so once you download it uh, let me just rename it to cool texture pack okay so you have that and then so you have this this is what you get but it'll say default texture pack so you can to rename it just click rename and that's it and you just change the name like I did right there so so you have that there pretty much and you have to go here and then you go on open and then uh, you just pick go on desktop you have to find the folder texture packs assets minecraft uh, textures and then pick whatever you want so you can pick items you can pick blocks um, so let's see let's just take a block okay so I've edited a few blocks right here so um, let's just take something else something that takes like no time at all uh, emerald ore okay so I'm probably not gonna I'm not gonna draw anything really you can you know I'm gonna draw something on just for example so you're gonna have to just open your tools this should be pretty easy or else you just find them in like tools and stuff like that so you're gonna have to open it a little bit and um you don't have to erase it but if you kind of fix the size of this because this is 16 by 16 pixels you can probably tell you can see all the pixels right here so if you want to make it like 64 by 64 which is considered HD um, it'll it'll look glitchy I'll show you but you have to go on um, canvas size and you have to change it so this is the width so it's 64 you can go all the way to all the way up to like 512 I think or something like that uh, which is it takes so many pixels and a lot of patience you'll get bored honestly so this is how it'll look like so you kind of zoom out of that and then you go on uh, layer and then you go layer to image size so now it's pretty much taking the whole picture not this square right here it takes the whole thing so you're just gonna erase this because obviously I guess you could also drag it let's say but you know it'll, you know just take more work and you want to make your own texture back so you don't need this so just draw something like I'll just for me it'll take two seconds so th look how small the pixels are here so this is gonna add a lot more details into it so let's just make it stone so make this bigger and let's select the, uh, one pixel right here and then pick the color so the colors right here you can just color inside make it anything you want it, it is HD so you can add details to it uh, you can also like smudge it or something like that that obviously doesn't work right now because I'm not yeah, like that looks really ugly but just example or you can just make your pixel size a lot smaller to like zero and then you can just put some stone and then like that 
It looks really bad. But, you know, so I'm just getting rid of that. So, the emerald color. So, I guess you can just draw some little pieces of emerald right here. Um, you know, it's not really hard. Try not to draw a lot. And, um, you can add detail into it. I won't really show that a lot. Just gonna do this quickly. So let's say I'll just do last one right here. Uh, sorry, it takes a while. So you just get the pretty much the basic color, and then you can start shading it, which will make it look nicer. Obviously, it looks really ugly right now because I'm taking two seconds. It takes patience. So let's just make it a little darker, and then add some some you know some shading onto it and then you can also add shading onto uh, like this part right here that like you can obviously make it look a lot better I'll show you after so um, yeah so that's pretty much it for now so we'll just say that's what you want even though it looks really bad so you will on um, you have to overwrite it so overwrite emerald or dot png always overwrite because or else it'll keep the same or like the previous uh, emerald ore then go on save as and then create emerald ore.xcf which is a game file and just put it in there it won't do anything to the file it won't really yeah it'll be fine um, so now we have that done go go on your texture pack folder you have to drag assets in it like all the pictures will be dragged in the cool texture pack uh, which is the name I've given to it and um just wait until this loads with WinRAR. Uh, usually when it gets like 90s, it takes a bit longer. So, when it's done, you're gonna have to drag the pack.mc meta in it, which takes like half a second. So now it's done. You go here and you go, so when you click done, you go back on resource packs and you see it's gone, so you open the resource pack folder. And then you drag and drop. So drag and drop cool texture pack in, and then it works. So it should work anyway. So once you go back on Minecraft, it's not there. You click done, and go back on resource pack, and then cool texture pack. So yeah, let's go in the game. Where yeah, let's just go in single player and uh, see how it looks like. Okay, so now you're in the game. I'm on my server right now. And like, see, look, this look at this cobblestone. It's actually not bad at all. Like, I could have made it better, but you know, it's pretty cool. Um, so let's look for stone. I made it invisible. It's pretty cool. You can see through it. It's like an X-ray, but you know, uh, dirt looks not bad. Doesn't look so bad, actually. Uh, other dirt, and let me just show you all the blocks I've uh, modified. Okay, so these are the blocks I've modified. Um, so you have HD thing right here. <laughs> you can't see it's HD though. Um, HD dirt, and then this other dirt turned into grass, so <laughs> gotta fix that. HD dirt, and then you have HD lapis, HD lapis block, and this is the ore I made. It doesn't look actually as bad, like the emerald part doesn't look as bad. It's just like the, the weird square stuff looks weird. And then this is uh, the coal block, which actually looks really nice, from my opinion. Uh, and these are the non, uh, not, like, the regular gra resolution, default resolution uh, blocks. They're not bad, actually. Like, this one could, uh, this one, eh, I could have made a lot better. This one's not bad. It reminds me of a Minecraft classic uh, bricks, and the rest aren't that bad either, or either. Um, and this is the diamond sword I made. It's pretty cool. Um, you can see, like, all the jewels on it. It's pretty sick. So, yeah, that's pretty much all you have to do, and, uh, yeah, to re-edit it, just, uh, put it back, well, you'll have to drag it out again if you want it to, like, re or not reset, but, like, update it again, so, you just draw the pictures again, so you open the folder, and asset, you open assets again, or assets, and you just keep drawing stuff, and it takes a while, but it's worth it, so, yeah, I hope this helped, and, uh, see you next, next time, guys, so, yep.